a POTS friendly floor workout. So we're gonna go through a series of on your back exercises and we'll move on to your stomach, all fours and those kind of things. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna lie on our back. Once we're in this position, make sure your knees are bent and we're gonna focus on breathing. We're gonna make sure that we're getting good circulation before we even start any of the exercises. So what helps is if you put your hand on your abdomen, all we're gonna do is take a deep breath in through your nose, inflating the abdomen or the diaphragm as it comes up and breathe it out through the mouth. And we'll start now. Notice I'm not straining. Nice and relaxed. And I like to do about six of them, so this will be number three. And now we're gonna move on into our leg series. So we're just gonna go ahead and put a band around our knees. Make sure it's a decent tension. You don't want too much, so it's not too difficult. So all I'm gonna do is just make sure my knees stay hip width apart. Again, my lower body is uh, nice and relaxed. And we're just gonna bridge up just about halfway. We're not going all the way up. So we're gonna push through our heels. We're gonna drive our hips up. Come back down, nice and slow. Keep this going. If you feel like you can do more, you can do more. Just make sure you're not pressing with your head as you push up. Okay. The next series that we're gonna do is the clamshell. So we're just gonna keep yourself in this position. What we wanna do is we're gonna bring the legs out away from middle and slowly control them back in. Again, make sure you're not holding your breath. Out to the side. Remember, you don't have to go all the way flat, so just bring about maybe about 45 degrees. Nice and controlled. We'll go ahead and take this one off here. Now what we're gonna do is we can grab some dumbbells, some light dumbbells. And just for general strength, we're just gonna do some chest presses. Our elbows are gonna be out to the side here. We're pushing them up, connecting them together. We're not letting them touch. We're coming back down to the floor, nice and controlled. Up and I recommend starting off with some lighter weight. So we'll set these to the side. We're gonna go ahead and go onto all fours. So in this position, we're gonna focus on cat camel. So really everything through the shoulder blade. Once we're here, hands below our shoulders, knees below our hips. And we're just gonna press up toward the ceiling and just lightly relax down. Again, round the back. Make sure you're controlling your breathing during this. Okay, so now we're going to try to do some arm raises here. This might be a bit more challenging, so depending on the height, you can see what works best for you, but we're just going to raise one arm up. We're just going to alternate nice and slow. Okay. 
Okay, so on this next one, we're gonna use our legs. So I like to take off my shoes here just so I can get a little bit of a slide. So the first one staying in this position, and we're gonna slide our legs straight and back in. If you feel like you're able to lift it, you can slide it straight, a little lift, back down, slide it, and then we're just gonna alternate just like this. Four, just straight. And the last thing we'll do here to end it, we're going to go back onto our back. Back into the belly breathing that we did earlier. So hand on the abdomen, taking deep breath in through the nose. Blow it out. Continue on for about five to six repetitions. Once you've completed that, go ahead and sit up. Take a few minutes here um, to rest. Let the blood circulate before you think about standing up, whether it's a minute or so, and then work your way into standing, and that completes the pot for a friendly workout.